how Miss Voth got married. From Egypt. And I was like, mom, there's a guy. First of all, I came like, like a little girl. I was like, I need to tell you something. <laughs> and she's like, oh, <laughs> she felt it. Cause I already had been prepping her like with questions. And she's like, oh, let me sit down. She sits down. She's like, what is it? I was like, somebody's coming to ask for my hand. And you know, um, yeah. What, what, what? And then she's like, who is it? Blah, blah, blah. Is he Muslim? I'm like, yeah, he's Muslim. And then I'm um, like, but he's a convert. He, he's been Alhamdulillah. A, Alhamdulillah. It's called a revert because we were all born Muslim, so it's not convert. Oh, it's yeah, true. yeah, yeah, that's true. The best of us are revert. She thought I, I think maybe in her head, she thought yeah. I was going to end up with somebody Arab, but I, I don't know. That's, it's, that's, they everybody that's paints a is, picture in their head yeah. of everything. I'm yeah. not even just my mom. Like, everybody thought I was going to end up yeah. with somebody Arab. But like, when I saw him, I was yeah. Like once I saw him, my my heart feels at ease. I was like, "What in the hell?" That's not what, that's not what it really means. What <laughs> yeah. translate? Tra I tell him to come over Thursday. Yeah. So I'm like, I'm, like third, I'm I'm in North Carolina. You know, it's only an hour and twenty minute flight. But yeah. I'm like, I am. You know, I'm nervous. Yeah, I've yeah. been through a lot of things in my life, right? Yeah, yeah. But this is the first time I'm truly like yeah. calm, sweating. Yeah. And I'm like. I got to figure this out. Yeah, How do yeah. I do? I've never asked yeah. any man for his daughter's hand or family for permission to marry their daughter. And it's a big thing. It's a dude. big deal. I've yeah. never been married. I don't have any kids. And I'm like, how do, yeah. how do I do this? How do I even approach it? How do I it's do It's like this? with everything. The most important thing that I was Muslim and that I wanted to raise Muslim kids. Yeah. And that was it. Like during a special moment. So like it was four or five days of him and I, every day I was getting dressed yeah, up, yeah, yeah. makeup, the whole thing. And I was like, oh my God, this is so intense. And then the proposal happened. He was like, yo, I'm taking you out to a dinner. So I got dressed. Um, and then I kind of felt like it was the day of, because he was like acting weird on the phone, texting. Like he he never texts like this. Yeah, yeah. You know, so he was doing a little bit of that. I was like, ooh, he's being secretive. And so we pulled up to this hotel. Which yeah. hotel? At the top. And I had flew my family in from North Carolina. I had ordered a, a bus to pick up her family from the house. And they all went there before us. And I told her that we were going to a sushi place where the chef picks the menu. You just go. It's mm. exclusive. You know, you don't just sit down. And it's, all, and it's only 13. <laughs> it's only right. 13 couples can go to this. And, yeah. and so we went upstairs and she, the elevator opens right into the penthouse. And then boom, she's, she's there. Yeah. Okay. And it was supposed to be like me and him moment. But my family, you know, my family yeah. and his family, they were there just yelling at each other. Like, guys, they're coming. They're yeah. coming. They're ready. <laughs> So, and then it was beautiful. There was like flowers, candles, and then there was like a sign that said, marry me. And then he got on one knee and he said something very, very sweet. Today, cause I did. <laughs> did you, did see you that? notice that? Yeah, I did not notice that. Oh my God. I forgot it today, but I am. So in psychiatry, there's something.